nearly $10 million in budget cuts, cuts that will impact medical and other services to the poor and disabled. A majority of the panel voted to lift a rules objection that had blocked those cuts from taking effect. The vote by five members of the Children, Families, Health and Human Services Interim Committee allows Medicaid provider rates to be cut by nearly 3%. State health officials say a bill passed by the 2017 legislature directed the agency to make the cuts if state revenue fell below a certain level. Helena State Senator Mary Caffaro, who opposed the cuts, tells MTN that the panel never got an explanation on why the Bullock administration chose the cuts it did. Why would we start with people in our state who have disabilities? I mean, why would you start with cutting the supports that they need to live in the community and be independent when you rely on that person, that worker, to show up to get you out of bed, help you shower, eat, and get off to your work day, and there's nobody showing up. Can you imagine what that must be like? And that's what we're cutting. Caffaro, who chairs that interim committee, voted against lifting the objection. The committee members who voted to lift the objection say the cuts are necessary in order to balance the state budget.